Virginia Beach couples fight against VDOT is over. The state Supreme Court handed down its decision on eminent domain. Ten of your sides, Jason Marks, was there when they heard the news. And Jason, this case sets a new standard for fighting the government, as a manner of speaking, right? Tom, it does. And the Ramseys were fighting on one simple principle, and that's to have a jury be able to hear all the evidence in the case. Today, only 10 on your side was there when the Ramseys heard the words they've been waiting for. We won. It's the moment of truth for Jim and Janet Ramsey. Anticipation, want to get it over with, want to find out what's going on. The Ramseys are waiting on an important phone call from their attorney. A decision by the Virginia Supreme Court that will affect the rest of their lives. We won. <laughs> The emotion comes from a long fight against VDOT. In 2009, VDOT took the Ramsey's land to make room for the London Bridge off-ramp from Interstate 264, land that's been in the family for almost a century. It's changed so much with the off-ramp coming through that, but it's still home, but it, it, it'll never be the same. VDOT originally offered $250,000 for the property. The Ramseys thought it was worth more. In fact, they had it appraised at $392,000. When the Ramseys refused to settle, VDOT came back and said the land was only worth 90000 I thought it was a joke. I thought they were kidding. No joke at all. When the case went to court, state law allowed VDOT not to tell the jury about its original offer. All the jury was told was that the land was worth 90000 And I'm really disappointed that the uh, uh, Department of Transportation's officials are pulling these sneaky tricks on the citizens. It's just unbelievable. The Ramseys took the case to the Supreme Court. They were asking the judges to rule that all the evidence should be introduced in trial. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Oh, thank you so much. Long time coming. The judges unanimously agreed, and the case will be heard again, this time with all the evidence. It's just elation because you ask somebody to believe in you and you ask somebody to trust you, and we lost at every stage until we got it up to the Supreme Court. So it, it was vindication. What do you do now to celebrate tonight? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Sit down and rest. <laughs> yeah, much needed rest, but they'll need to start preparing for another trial in Virginia Beach against VDOT. This time, all that evidence will be heard. We did get a one-line statement from VDOT saying it is reviewing the court's ruling to determine how to proceed. In the newsroom, Jason Marks, 10 on your side.